We believe that our democracy needs citizens who take action now more than ever. So we stand here today, elected officials, candidates, party officials, and everyday Democrats, because we believe that a call to unity and action is now. We have a lot of issues on the ballot uh, this, this, uh, this November. Uh, and the Republican Party, is, of course, is trying to uh, take power away from the Democratic Party. But we want to be united in making sure that we keep our voices heard and we keep um, all of our collective efforts together. We want to make sure that we're united behind each and every last one of our candidates to make sure that the Democratic values uh, of this city and this state uh, continue to make for us. The opportunity to vote is precious. The right to vote is precious. The responsibility to vote is equally precious. And we, in this day and time, more so than ever, we understand the challenges and the opportunities that are out there facing each and every one of us. A call to action means coming together. A call to action means speaking with one voice. We are a people of one voice and a community of one voice that has an echo chamber. It's like a choir that has a uh, different tones but you sing together and that's what is represented here and that's what's represented going forward it's an invitation to join a undertaking it's an invitation to come together and i would extend that invitation to everybody in the community to help be a part of it to move our community forward we're challenging all of you uh, to join the democratic party if you are the democratic persuasion uh, we care about each individual around this county, not just the seat of Florence, uh, but down in Lake City, down in Johnsonville, Olana, Timminsville, Quimby, uh, Stratton, Coward. We care about everything that happens in this county. And so these elected officials are committed from their seat to change the tide of our communities and move us forward by everybody working together.